Hi, my love, beautiful souls. This is Mystic Rose 1111. I'm back with the truth, bringing dark into life. This is a time must read. So when you guide to this truth, clarity, confirmation, message you're looking for. You may be also guided to my channel. So my soul mission is waking you guys up to higher self, higher conscious, and if I need. Please take what resonates and leave what does not fit for somebody else. Collectively, not first frame. Collectively, not first frame. Thank you to everyone liking, sharing, subscribing. Thank you, thank you so much, guys. I love you. I would not be wrong. Matt's not for you guys for the most high. So thank you so much. If you're new, hit the like button, share, subscribe, hit the bell to be notified. If you'd like to join the two seeking members, it's 399 per month. The bonus gives this one question. What's going on here, Holy Spirit Angels? Is this a high school light for the most time? Let's go for the collective. Somebody's trying to trap somebody, okay, with a baby or trap them with a relationship, okay? That's confirmation right there. Somebody's trying to trap somebody, entrapment. This could also be a legal entrapment as well. But somebody's done. They want to walk away. They don't want to be a part of it. Lessons learned. Okay. You guys, it's not always female trapping um, masculines. Okay. Masculines can be trapping females too. Intentionally like popping the hole in the condom to get a female pregnant as well. Okay. But I'm kind of hearing something about like. Somebody's trying to keep somebody stuck. Like blocking them in. Road blocking them. Okay. Blocking them in. I'm getting like a legal situation here. Trapment. Somebody keeps like the cops keep coming to somebody's house. Okay, keep pulling up. They're raiding the house. Somebody, wow. Somebody should, like, learn some lessons, completed the lessons, but somebody keeps coming back in and trying to, um, stir the pot. Okay, somebody's about to confess. Hmm, verge. About to confess something. Something important. They could be pregnant. Okay, to try to keep the person as well. Realization, awareness, finding out, coming to light. Some of you try to keep traveling with money, too. I'm also hearing somebody say, Oh, if you stay with me, I'll give you money. Oh, I'll pay for your stuff. You stay with me. Don't leave me. Don't leave me. I'll pay for you. And then I'm hearing authorities are really realizing that, okay. There's authorities um, realizing that there's a trap house. A lot of things are happening in this trap house. Somebody's about to confess about it. But what's going down, we have bounty hunter, hot pursuit, chasing. Because there's poisonous people, toxic, unhealthy behaviors, people that could be a trap house. Bounty hunter. Somebody has a bounty out on them. Focused. Stay focused. Eyes for you, watching, fascinating, watching. Like, there's, there's a private eye, there's an investigator, there's undercovers, okay? task force okay focus on a certain helm they're focused they're like not leaving okay they're making sure something that they need to do this take like take down trap house okay they're focused on a trap house forbidden love tragedies there's something that happened something bad that happened i'm hearing like a ghost house too like something can happen like a ghost house talk interview this could be interrogation. Somebody being interrogated for a crime. They're entrapped in a crime. You may be seeing messages, synchronicities, signs, 111, 1111, 222, 333. Somebody's been hustling. Chained down, anchored, gripped, weighed down. Somebody's going to get locked up. Somebody's going to be in shackles. It's the same thing, gripped, anchors, chain, weighed down, locked down. Mental prisoner confined, okay? Somebody could be in, getting locked up. Okay, that could be some kind of entrapment too, in like a prison. Somebody's trapping somebody in prison. Wow. And then there's like a lockdown. Somebody got hurt. Trash. Okay, some about trash. Somebody could be, like be a janitor. Can mean somebody could be a janitor. Working in the laundry room. Janitor work. Some kind of receipt, some kind of proof on the situation. Show me it. Somebody could be in denial if somebody is pregnant. Not facing truth, irrational reasoning. Somebody could be in denial. Not wanting to believe it until they see it. There's a divine masculine or a masculine. This doesn't just have a masculine card, so it's divine. Somebody who's single, okay? Somebody that's single, wanting to mingle, 
And this is crushed, sad, broken, feeling alone. Somebody could be writing about the situation as well. Journaling, keeping notes. Okay, there's going to be a lot of notes taking as well. If somebody's in lockdown or like locked up, they feel trapped, okay? They feel like they've been um taken advantage. Somebody wants immunity. They're going to beg for immunity. You guys, the authorities entrap people a lot, okay? They do, okay? I've seen it happen. It's happened um, to a friend of mine, okay? They will continue to pick on the same person over and over, Okay? Because they just won't, they, they have nothing better to do. Gangs will entrap people as well. Bounty hunters sometimes entrapped as well. Somebody's flighty all over the place. Spirit, what else? It said raid. It said home raid. Okay? Somebody's getting raided after raid after raid after raid. They just keep getting raided. Okay? I, I kind of had this once before. Somebody may move apartments, and every apartment they move to, they get raided. Okay? Don't spend money. I need some water. Yeah, somebody moves homes. And I did see the home card in this deck too, and I didn't take it. I didn't, I didn't think of it at first. Somebody keeps moving homes, and when they move homes, they keep getting raided. Their home is a trap house. Raid after raid after raid. That's why they're feeling entrapped, okay? Being trapped. Somebody in a trap house could get pregnant as well. And that could be the case as well. Somebody's not caring about what happens to them or not caring what's happening in a home. This is giving me too many fucks, but I'm hearing not caring, okay? Somebody needs to start carrying a little bit more. Eviction notices. I keep hearing fiction notices, okay? Your soul contract has been broken with this person. Satanic. Some have been uh, interrogated several times. Like, have been interviewed, like, you know what I mean? Like, interviewed several times, interrogate over and over and over. And, like, I'm hearing one person telling, like, the same story, but I'm hearing another person, like, changes up their story every time. Okay? They talk a lot. Somebody talks a lot. Somebody about a restaurant. Okay, somebody could have been involved with a robbery, thief, or burglary. Caution, watch out for this person. Local cops are involved. Somebody is going to jail prison. Court case. Somebody may be able to fight the authorities because of entrapment. They may have able to... Okay, so like, if, like I'm hearing like if they keep raiding somebody's same house over and over and it's the same house, like you can get in trouble, especially if you don't find anything in that home the first time. But what I'm hearing is like there's another safe case where I'm hearing like they... um keep raiding this person's home that keeps moving and they find something in every time so they have a right to raid the home again because they found it every time they found something in the home every time and they just move out because they get evicted because they've been raided or you know what i mean like you know say you know police at your house authorities at your house so you get evicted and so you go to another place and then that place gets as a trap house and people keep getting coming there again Finally, somebody's just gonna have enough of this, okay? It's like, 
they're over like so much corruption they're just over it Seeing somebody just laying on the bed all the time being lazy doesn't do anything but laying on the bed because everyone do the bitch work for them as everyone does something for them. Person thinks that she's a queen or king. Planted evidence. Okay, that could be why they felt entrapped. Some kind of planted evidence. Transport her. So make have been transporting something. Gambling away their money on drugs. Gambling their money away on casinos. I'm hearing um, lottery tickets. Pray with me. Don't play with me. Male neighbor talking to feds. Just going down. That could be why. Okay. What else? You bossed up. Somebody, like, earlier remember somebody's on the verge of saying something? Somebody's on the verge of, like, like if they're going to the feds, they're on the verge of, like, literally, like, stopping this, all this stuff. Some, like it says, um, on the verge to confess, somebody wants, to, somebody wants to turn somebody in, okay? Somebody wants to go to authorities. Or tell them that they're pregnant. Somebody wants to talk about they're pregnant. Coming to get them. That fell on the floor. Felony. Put it back to everybody. Felony. Thank you. Someone will be subpoenaed. This neighbor may be subpoenaed. They witness everything. They see everything. Don't take in. Somebody is using drugs. They're not sober. Okay, they're not clean. They're they're high. They're high as fuck. Time's up. Some may have jury trial. Feds are involved. Criminals watching somebody's ass. Watching your ass. Watching. They could be watching the criminals too. And there's a corruption part again. The neighbor hears everything on the police scanner. This is all on the police scanner. This house too. This house is okay. So there, there's there would be a house that's like actually considered like a trap house where like entrapment where. Okay, I'm gonna give a little thing. Like I went to a house where there was somebody that called in warrants all the time. Okay, it was their home, and like, they literally did not ever get in trouble. And they could be sitting on the couch getting fucking high. And they would call the authorities, call the cops, and say, hey, somebody here is with a warrant. Um, I don't want nothing to touch my house. This is my home. Please come to my home. Get this person out. But, you know what I mean? Like, so, like, somebody could be working with the cops, could be an informant, and, like, not getting in trouble ever. They're part of corruption. Like, like it might not be corruption, but, like, coming in a home, and it's like entrapment. Like, they're trapping people with warrants, bad pe other people. Like, literally having these people come there and getting, war getting them on warrants. Do you get what I mean? So, there's a home I went to. A female's home I went to. She would have people after one another, after one another, doing heroin, doing freaking meth, coming in all the time. And people were getting arrested left and right. Okay? They're getting left and right. She her, she was protected. and um, But people were getting arrested. Like, she allowed these people to come there because she knew that she could get them on their charges. And actually, I knew a guy, too. His house finally got foreclosed. Like, his house finally got shut down. Because it was continued to happen. There was warrants after warrants after warrants after warrants coming there. And the guy that owned the house never, it never happened. Nothing bad happened to him. He never ended up going to jail. Because he was calling these people in that had warrants, letting them do drugs. And the cops would just come there to get the warrant and leave. Because they just wanted the person on the warrant. They didn't look at anything else. They didn't look at anybody else with their drugs or anything like that. They let everything else slide. But they got the people that were live with warrants. Okay, that's an entrapment like this one. I'm hearing some kind of entrapment like that, or in a vehicle. Okay, in a vehicle, something can be happening that way too. Somebody's ready to talk about this. Somebody's ready to open up. 
Hey, somebody knows something. Hey, they want to come forward with this. In that home, on that car. Somebody could be living with this person. And they're sick of it. Like, they don't, they, you know. Like, this, the, and whoever the person or the owner of the home is. The one who was a rent, she rented the house. Because she actually rented the house. Okay, she was in her 40s. She was very fucking lazy. She was very fucking lazy. And, like, she made everyone do everything else. And, honestly, I did stuff for her, too. Like, yeah. Okay? She was calling people in left and right. Um, the other one, um, he wasn't, I don't even know. I really don't know him too much. I've been there, like, once, twice. I met my mom knew him, too. He wasn't actually in my group of people. I actually didn't hang out with him a lot, but I knew what was happening there. Um, the point was I didn't go there, really, because I wasn't friends with him. They were a different group of people. Um, but I knew what was happening. Um... Wow, my gosh, I lost track. Oh, but there could be some kind of roommate. And this roommate is tired of it. I mean, this roommate's tired of this this in and out, this stuff going on. And maybe that they're the one. See, it could be a neighbor, too. A neighbor roommate, you know. And now they're going to go to somebody. Now on the verge of, like, spilling the beans about the situation. Somebody doesn't like... Somebody wants somebody to know that this person could be a snitch. Or informant. Or trapping people. Okay? It could be coming forward. Because, like I said, raid after raid after raid. This person's house has been raided several times. I'm hearing three plus times. Somebody's home has been raided three plus times. It may not be the same home, but somebody has been raided three plus times. Okay, they've been raided at least three times by the task force. For some kind of legal activity. And then and I'm hearing several times they didn't go to jail. Okay, several times they didn't go to jail. They could have went to jail one time, but I'm hearing several times they didn't go to jail. They get raided, and then it's, like, just done. Somebody has inside help. Somebody has like a secret society or like a virtual stuff, censorship trying to shut you up, stop you from telling the truth, blocking you. We can have Christian. Someone could be Christian, Christianity, or somebody find Christ. Okay, we have Gemini coming out. I mean, Jesus puts hands on you, or have Jesus put hands on you to heal you. It doesn't need to be healed. Somebody could be a spiritualist. As I said, arrest warrants. Busted. This person could be getting raided because of property theft. Receiving stolen property. Every time they could be something different. Burglary, robbery, grand theft, auto, thief, person snatching, intellectual, pickpocketing, copywriting. I'm hearing this person could be like, um, it could be different reasons, different, like different times. Like it could be raid for uh, drugs, it could be raid for theft, it could be raid, raid for stolen property, it could be raid for fucking hiding something out for a warrant. Each time it's different. Ego trip and power hungry. Yeah, this person thinks that their their shit don't stink. I say calls, emergencies, okay, nine one calls, altercations, hospitals, accidents, help. They were framing people. It wasn't me. It was you framed. They were framing other people, and they're blaming on others. And the reason they're doing this is because it's crowded people. So it doesn't like the reason that they're doing this stuff is because there's more than one person there, so they can't know. Like the person can't know who it is, so they wait for like. Several people be there. So that's what's happening. And that's when I was there. That's how it happened. Like, there'd be a group of people. And, like, the cops would come. And, like, we went, none of us would get searched if we didn't have a warrant. None of us could search. None of us could talk to. But the person that had the warrant would get talked to. And they would leave. Like, they would take them out. But no one else got talked to about it. At all. They just let everything go. They're like, oh, we're here for a warrant. We're here to pick this person up. We're taking the person out. And then, like, we're all like... Buddhist. It's the closest friends, you know what I mean? Like, one it's the closest friends, too. You guys, this is real stuff. Real shit that happens. I've experienced it. I've been there. Okay? I know people. Virgo. Mississippi. Route 66. 
People were making false reports too. And the crazy thing too is on in one of the homes I was at that this happened to, these people are good people. They just had a warrant. They missed court. They missed their probation office meeting, okay? They missed a meeting and stuff like that. Um, and somebody gave them a false report, you know? False reputation. Fake news. Between 40 and 50. Taurus deals with the devil, clout, fame, money. It's how they keep themselves out of trouble. Come in ties. See this group effort. Gang, going to practitioner, help from a group. This person also possibly put some big people away. Okay? Some big people away because of it. Sagittarius and gang affiliated. Certified. You guys, if you are in the street life and you're an, an addict, watch who you're with because most times, most likely, it's going to be the people you trust. It's going to be your friends, so-called friends, your drug addict friends, or people that you trust that calls you an unwarrant. Okay? They're the ones that call you in. It's not just usually random people, you guys. It's people that you're closest to. How else do you think it happens? You think just a normal person that doesn't do drugs, that's just walking down the street, doesn't call somebody in, or they don't see them? No. A normal person most likely don't even know half those people. All of a sudden, the most wanted. Cops like to trap people. All law enforcement's in trap. They trap. Other people trap. It's a trap. Like, that's what we just heard. It's a trap. They're setting a trap for you. I'm hearing Dave, I'm hearing Sean, I'm hearing Kirsten. I'm hearing Mark. Melissa. Ethan. Amanda. Anna. Ian. Dustin. Chad, time to focus on self. Do what you love and do it with what you love. Skinhead. Cowboys. I'm hearing James. Jimmy. Six of Pentacles aligned with service to, for others. Katie or Kate. Katie or Kate. Six of Pentacles aligned with others for service. Robert. Being censored. And there goes again. Donnie. Julia. McAdams. I'm hearing Angela. F250. Clean Energy. Drew. Garrison. Brown. So I'm just trying to hide out. Hide out. Biker. Bowen. I'm hearing Bowen. Wicca Pagan. I'm hearing Jake, Las Vegas, Philadelphia, Point Guard, Keller, Ridge, Tim, how long will you punish me and remind me what I did? Adventure Island, Kennedy, Micah, Layton, I'm hearing Muhammad, Indianapolis, something big will happen before the next full moon, I'm hearing Cassie, Jersey Shore, Escape, Deny for a Loan, Jamaica, I'm hearing Jesse, or Jessica, 
Jess, Heather, Frank, Rodriguez, Julio, there's a lot of names coming out there. I don't care. Shouldn't be doing what you're doing. Break in. They're kind of going to break in. I'm here, Dennis. Aaron. JR. You are the future. Your family betrayed you. Not as masculine as divine. Feds are watching. Hmm, right there. Feds are watching. They're coming in a car wreck. People are energy vampires. A prophecy is coming true. Positive mindset. You are stronger than your enemies. Their mission failed. One more. You go on the spiritual ascension, awakening. You're stronger than enemies. You're stronger than the devil. If they're trying to trap you, okay, so maybe they're trying to trap you. Maybe you got away from the situation. Maybe you got away from all of this. They're trying to trap you, okay? Be careful. Don't go to the person's house because they keep getting raided. Raid after raid after raid, okay? The feds are on something watching them, the locals and stuff like that. And you could be receiving channel messages. Somebody's house keeps getting raided after raid after raid. The local authorities keep raiding this house. The task force keeps raiding this house. And, like, nothing has been done until now the feds are going to raid it. And that's what's going to happen. This goes to shut, shut this shit down. Because the locals keep raiding this home and they've done nothing. And what's going to happen is the Fed's going to shut this shit down. Witness may fear coming forward with valuable information. Somebody may be scared. Somebody may be threatened to. Or fall. Or I'll okay, say they're going to get some repercussions from it. Somebody's passing through the area, traveling, driving by, train track. One more. Surveillance cameras may provide a part of clues. Yeah, there's something about the feds like been looking into the situation for a while and been wondering why this house hasn't been shut down. Why has like is things can still happen here? Why are things happening here still? So there's some kind of internal affairs situation happening. Person's home continues to get raided. And they get to walk. This person's home continues to get raided and they get to walk away. And they don't get in trouble. Don't know why. Something, Something's up. They're, they're snitching. They're telling on people. That's why. Okay, this house, this person's house, this individual's house keeps getting raided and they don't ever get to go to jail. They never go to jail. There's something up with this, some kind of snitching. 15. Leadership expansion, financial business. 2 to 2. This is a family, this is a home, some kind of home, okay? Home situation. Balance, family, love, trust, harmony, hope, life choices, strength, your faith headed in the right direction. 44, 33. Someone could be 44 years old, someone could be 33 years old. 
If you have worries or doubts, call upon angelic realms, angels for support. Slow and steady wins the race, deep breathing. Sagittarius, Capricorn, Gemini, and number six. Sagittarius, Capricorn, Gemini, number six. I love you guys. Love you. Oh, I gotta do one more. Gemini again. Virgo. I love you guys. Love, peace, light, heal, namaste.